But he was in a lot of pain because he couldn't take any kind of pressure. How'd you put it on purpose? So and he was like, "Oh, I want to, I saw your YouTube and I wanted to try it out." And so literally, my videos of him of his uh, chest are just him me touching him, him just screaming, "Never mind, I don't want it, I don't want it, I don't want it." <laughs> And so many people post videos and pictures of themselves looking nothing like what they do. There was one guy, I don't follow him on Instagram, but I saw him on Instagram and I was like, that dude is hot. He looks familiar though. But like, I don't, who is he? And I was like looking at his Instagram and I'm like, God, he looks familiar. And I'm just scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. And then finally I see on his Instagram, oh, he works out at 24 hour fitness midtown. Like, I used to work out there because I used to live nearby. That's weird. And then I'm scrolling, I'm like, no. No. Huh. And I'm like, that man has never been that lean at the gym. And some people, when they get really lean, look very different. Oh, yes. But, you know, all his pictures, he, I guess he just took pictures where he was, like, really lean and would just constantly, like, upload, upload those, like, as if he looked that way all the time. <laughs> and I was like, no, he's, like, 20 per, 20% body fat when you see him. But all his pictures are, like, sub 10% body fat. <laughs> And if he modeled for me when he's sub 10, I would pay him a lot of money because he's when he's sub 10, it's like, holy crap. Like he could be at the black Superman. <laughs> right. I so need a roller. Mm -hmm. I'll give you a second. I don't know why I'm filming on that. Well, I guess I can use the 3D camera. For what? Oh, here. Well, because they can't, they can't see my working on Oh, for the roller? No, they can't see my working on you <sighs> on the other side. Are you, what, what do I have? Well, well, I, thought you, I thought you said you needed the water. Oh, <laughs> no, but yes. Mm -hmm. In a way, yeah. Uh, but I, I said I need a roller. Oh, okay. Like to... To buy a roller. I used yeah. to roll out every day before and after my workouts. Mm -hmm. And then I just stopped. <laughs> yeah, I saw one guy at the gym like a long time ago. Ah. I was like, you're the one of the few people I've ever seen who look, there's nothing I can look at you like, oh, I can help you with this or that. And like, what do you do? He says, oh, you know, well, I, you know, I come here and I work out for an hour and then I roll for like 45 minutes. Ah. Like, it's magic. I had a sciatic nerve pinched. Mm hmm Went to see doctors, went to see chiropractors. Mm -hmm. uh, always had massage doctors, but uh, yeah. I'm not gonna do this too much. I don't like doing neck massage. I like. I don't mind doing neck massage. I don't like doing neck massage all day. Neck massage all day. Yeah, like if you like if you know a massage therapist, like I can't make any money. Get good at neck massage. There are so many people around the world who work in an office and who have like neck pain. And you will just be rolling in customers because they are very, you know, very loyal. They come in all the time. But I, when I worked the massage heist, I was doing, there were days I would go and just do neck massage all day. So six, six massages a day, all neck. And it gets boring. I can't imagine, yeah. People come in, you know, oh, you know, my neck is hurting. Okay, I got to work here, 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 here. It's like, it's, it gets boring. That's I rarely post a video of me doing neck massage. Because if you just post a video of you doing neck massage, they will fly in. It's like neck massage and stress massage are like these like that's what most massages. People come in because they're stressed out and their neck hurts. Yeah. It's common. To build all the stress right there. And really, it's in your shoulders, but mm -hmm. all muscles are connected. Yeah. So if one's failing, even though it's all the way in the bottom, like with your feet, yeah, most likely your back is gonna hurt. Yeah. Well, the muscles in your neck are, you know, they're they connect to your shoulders. So this muscle I'm working on you right now, 
It can, if someone has a lot of anger issues and they have a hard time breathing, um, if they're looking at their phone all day uh-huh. or looking down on the laptop, okay. it can cause a lot of pain. But then if it pulls your head forward because of those reasons, it can cause pain in the back of your neck. Hmm. And people don't know about the breathing one. But when you have a forced inhale, and that's when if you have breathing problems, you do that a lot more than other people, this muscle pulls your clavicle up. So if you're constantly, <gasps> this uh, muscle yeah. contracts and it's constantly pulling the clavicle. Mm. And that's the other thing. People who have neck pain, they don't, they just want you to crush their neck all day. And it's like, it's a lot more nuanced than that. And they don't allow you to do that nuanced work. So they just want me to work the back of the neck. But right. it's like, literally, I've worked on people with neck pain and I'm like working in here, telling them to open and close their mouth over and over. Hmm. And it helps with their neck pain. Really? Mm-hmm. down here for like neck pain but this is where that sternocleidomastoid inserts you're working here around the clavicle especially the the chest so that clavicle can move more easily when your muscle when bones can't move or joints can't move then you know other joints and bones may move instead and that's what causes like a lot of pain okay. like what you said with the foot in the lower back that's actually like you're one of the few people who've ever known that without me telling them but foot pain can cause low back pain. Actually, if your toes don't contract correctly, they can um, it can cause low back pain. Hmm. If your toes don't contract correctly, what will happen is that um, your feet will turn out when you walk, and then that will cause low back pain. Okay. And so I took a class once where what we were doing was literally having you like take your shoes off and walk and we would look to make sure your toes were contracting in the correct way. And if not, then we would have you do exercises to strengthen your toes. Hmm. I think I have oh, toes that. Uh. Yeah, one exercise you can do. I walk like it's uh, like a duck. Yeah, that could be toes. It can also be um, that your glutes are too tight. Really? Well, I walk like that even when I'm like.